am Navya, a cloud support engineer here at the AWS office in Bangalore. Today, I'm going to show you how to use an Nginx proxy to access Amazon OpenSearch dashboards with Amazon Cognito authentication from outside a virtual private cloud. Let's get started. First, let's create an Amazon Cognito user pool. Open the Amazon Cognito console. Choose user pools and then select create a user pool. For application type, choose traditional web application. For name your application, enter a custom application name or keep the default name. For options for sign in identifiers, choose username. For required attributes for sign up, choose email. Select create user directory. After the user pool is created, navigate to it. Under branding, choose managed login. For domains with managed login branding, choose update version. For branding version, choose hosted UI classic. Now, navigate to user management and select users. For creating a user, select create user. Enter a username and set a password for your user. After the users are created, let's go ahead and create an identity pool. Go to the identity pool section and then select create identity pool. For user access, choose authenticated access. For authenticated identity sources, enter Amazon Cognito user pool. For IAM role, choose create a new IAM role and then enter a role name. For user pool details, select your user pool ID and then choose app client ID. For role settings, choose use default authenticated role. For claim mapping, choose inactive. Enter a name for your identity pool and then select create identity pool. Now that both the user pool and identity pool are created, Let's activate Amazon Cognito authentication on the OpenSearch domain. Open the OpenSearch console, select your domain and then select Edit Security Configuration. For Cognito user pool, select your user pool. For Cognito identity pool, select your identity pool. For domain access policy, Enter the IAM ARN of the identity pool roles ARN. To fetch the IAM roles ARN, navigate to identity pool, select your identity pool and then select user access and copy the ARN. Select save changes. Now let's go ahead and configure the Nginx proxy. Open the Amazon Elastic Compute Cloud Console and then select Launch an Instance. Enter a name for your EC2 instance. For instance type, choose m5.2x large. For key pair, choose a key pair. For network settings, Choose a public subnet belonging to the same VPC has OpenSearch domain. For security group, choose the same security group as OpenSearch domain. Select launch instance.
Now let's SSH into the instance and install nginx with the following commands. Because we are in a testing environment, let's generate a self-signed certificate instead. It's a best practice to use SSL certificates that are signed by a third-party certificate authority only in your production environment. To generate a self-signed certificate, execute the following command. Navigate to the etc nginx config directory and then create a file that's named default.config. For etc nginx cert.crt, enter the path to your SSL certificate. For etc nginx cert.key, enter the path to the private key that you generated for the SSL certificate. Yeah. For my domain host, enter your open search service endpoint. For my Cognito host, enter your Amazon Cognito user pool domain. To get your user pool domain endpoint, navigate to your user pool, under branding, select domain and then copy your Cognito domain. The resolver value changes based on your VPC settings. Use the DNS resolver at your primary CIDR block's base IP address plus 2. For example, if you create a VPC with CIDR block 10.0.0.24, then your DNS resolver is located at 10.0.0.2. Optionally, to assign my domain host and my Cognito host as variables, run the following set commands. If you run this command, then you don't have to replace my domain host and my Cognito host in the default.config file located in etc nginx config directory. To activate and start nginx proxy, run the following command. Now you can access open search dashboard by opening the nginx server IP or DNS name in your browser. You will then be redirected to the Amazon Cognito login page to authenticate. Enter your username and temporary password to log in into the OpenSearch dashboard. When prompted, change your password and log in again. And now you know how to use an Nginx proxy to access Amazon OpenSearch dashboards with Amazon Cognito authentication from outside a VPC. Thanks for watching and happy cloud computing from all of us here at AWS.